We love dragons. We. That's okay. Uh, put the thing on the screen. It'll be great. All right. Uh, <laughs> appreciate the donation. Love your videos. Help me when climbing the ranks. Question. Has the Moomoo been any set so far? So we were actually just talking about this. Okay. So you know how in League of Legends, uh, they do that thing where on Reddit, they just complain about which champ hasn't had a skin in the longest. I think right now everyone's complaining about Dr. Mundo. Um, so we were talking about this. So obviously it's Ramus right now. Ramus hasn't been in TFT. Um, by the way, Mirage is Pirates. Uh, Namzi is not Cannoneer. Sorry, one second. Namzi is Evoker again. Okay, uh, yeah, Zillion's another one. So we're like, if Ramus ever does finally get in TFT, people are going to start shifting and complaining about the next thing. So we were going through and figuring out which champions other than Ramus haven't been in the set the longest or in TFT the longest and the answer is Karthus uh, Karthus hasn't been in since set 1 and then it was a Mumu in set 2 and there was one other one there was one other champion in set 2 it was a Mumu I'm forgetting but yeah so th that, we were interestingly talking about those. Uh, Yorick, that's who it was. Yorick, thank you. Yorick, it was Yorick, thank you. Cool. Uh, if you if the Smash roster was ever made into an auto battler, what are some units abilities you'd want to see? Oh, I I could talk about that one for ages, but yeah, I would love to. The problem is the only problem with the Smash roster is like trying to come up with like origins and things that work together well would be hard. So I almost think you'd have to do an auto battler that's like not based on traits and origins, which is possible. So, uh, Donkey Punch Inc. <laughs> Still a great name. Appreciate the 8th month. Last patch of the set, Ramus is a 10 cost dragon. Nope. Nope. Somehow I lost this fight. How did I lose this fight? Whatever. Whatever. Do you think it would be a viable buff to Astral System where Asol would grant double the amount? I don't think... It... At that point, Astral doesn't need buffs. Like... When Astral can get to that point, it's already strong enough. All right, you're all gonna disagree with this play, but I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna level, and then we're gonna hit a Volibear. And we're gonna play Pirate Shimmer Ski. <laughs> Pirate Shimmer Scale. It'll be great. Funny looking Volibear? Your face is a funny looking Volibear. Yeah, it's just the meta right now is basically who has the dragons and the dragon mancers that are high HP. And who has the things that are high enough, so, like, long-term DPS to kill those things. Which is why, like, Swift Shot Yone works, but not much else. This is why things like Namzi don't work. Namzi doesn't have sustained DPS, Namzi has burst DPS. Burst DPS sucks against high health targets. Yeah. That's kind of the boat we're in right now.
Namzi's good? No, Namzi's not good. Namzi's quite terrible. Is there a plan to... No, it, it's not... It's not a buff nerf about a specific thing. It's the... It's dragons, man. Dragons are something. Oh, hey, it's Swift Shot Skarner. We love Swift Shot Skarner. Since TFT original units did become more frequent in TFT with some dragons, is there any chance there'll ever be a set, a, a set of only originals? No, never. That's basically impossible. There's no way we'd have the time to do that. A few special units here and there, sure. A set of entirely originals? No way. If you could implement any change to the game tomorrow purely out of personal preference but not gameplay statistics, what would you do? Uh, the I, never mind. I can't say. I'm not allowed to say. No, got him. <sighs> Every f carousel, man. Oh, hey, Koala. Hope you're doing well. I just don't have the energy in me, man. Maybe it's a sign I'm working too much. Maybe. <laughs> Copium. You don't sound too good. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. There's going to be a Deja in my next shop, and we'll be fine. Fine. Da -da 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 we lose this. This person. This person's me. This person is literally my comp. In a... Dark flight pivot somehow from here. Oh, come on. It couldn't even be the Deja. It couldn't even be the Deja. Are you kidding me? This doesn't make any sense. Let's do it.
dun 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 it's okay, this is the part of the game where uh, Swain's like good. Because they don't have enough burst to get through and they don't have anti-healing, so we can win these fights. So, cool. Alright, something useful. Please, something useful. Anything useful. This was not useful. All right, feels like the Shimmer Scale Dream is dead. All right, it's something. It is a functional comp. That's a three-star Ezreal. Okay. We're going to lose. Although the Ezreal has no burst, so maybe. Maybe. Not looking good, though. Ugh, cast. Nice. Good cast. I hope you're having a relaxing morning. Nope. It has not been a great morning. Oh, sure, now the Volibear shows up. Hmm. We need a Deja. It's three Mirage buffed, yeah. You got me. You got me. I'm letting the wrong YouTube channel thing run. That's a lot of Kirby songs. Why did anybody tell me I'm playing like a jillion Kirby songs? Do I lose this? Really? Oh my god. Have the tournament players been selected notified yet? I don't think so. I think they're about to be notified this week. I know, all it took was me going down to last place to get the item I wanted. Let's go. Too much true damage. You need a nacho break? True. I have been like, so I've been really good lately and I've been on a good diet, but I have been stress eating lately. 
It's really bad. It's not great. Do you have plans for further nerfing Rengar? No, I think Rengar's fine right now. Rengar's right where he's supposed to be. Is it relieving stress at least? I mean, yes and no. I've been like, I've. Ugh. The New York Philly cheesesteak was really good though. And the pizza. New York pizza was good. New York pizza was good. I'm good a boot. <laughs> That's what I was hoping for was a boot. Still not a deja. Although the item was good. Interesting. This is awkward. Is it just a boring six dark flight game? It might be. What division is this? The division of your face. Obviously, I need to get rid of frickin' this soon. Yeah, it's just a Dark Flight game. Kinda dull. Where are these scores and what have you done with the real Mort Dog? The real Mort Dog's been working on set 8, <laughs> so he's very out of practice in this set. So we level up to eight. We play like Neela probably. Are there plans for a for fun patch? Yep. 
Yep. If you can tell us this on a scale of 1 to 10, how excited are you for set 8? So, it's for different reasons. Like, for certain reasons, I would say a 9. For other reasons, I would say a 7. Though, I think that lower number is coming from the fact that I'm just, like, looking at what we still have to do and going, we still have a lot to do. Um, but, yeah. Yay! Buffing odds of prismatic augments in the for fun patch? Nope. Nope. Do you plan to continue having multiple champ tiers at 4 or 5 cost? Uh, all I can say is that there are not going to be dragons in the next set. That is what I'm allowed to say. Sorry, when I say there are no dragons, what I mean is there are no two cost champions that take up two slots, or two, there are no double cost champions that take two slots that give plus three to their trait. <laughs> that is what I mean when I say there are. Uh, Thankfully, we should be able to... The Morello will burn the three stars here. We should be okay. We ended casual streak. We did it. Swain did something. Woohoo! All right, this will be the last turn I run, Leona. We'll ditch Mirage after this round. Is this viewer games? Uh, it's not per se, but they invited me to a group and I played in a pre-made, but I wouldn't call it viewer games. We didn't actually set up viewer game lobbies. Rengar's trying his best back there. Go, Rengar, go! Also, hey, Arnold, how you doing? I mean, the early Swain 2 is going good. The only problem with Swain is he starts to fall off around stage 5. So... I'm gonna... This is so risky. No, I'm gonna... Shit, I'm running out of time. Problem is, how do I get this where it needs to be? How do I get this where it needs to be? Reforge the entire swing? That is such a stupid idea. There's no way that can be the right play.
Rengar is trying. Nope. Close. Well, no, there's one other option that's really risky, but... I've got enough HP, I can do it. Yeah, I'm gonna remake the swing. It's probably worth it. Are you not using essence on purpose? I mean, an entire Ornn item just to get essence doesn't really feel worth it. So, and at least the Protector's Vow are giving my Swain extra armor and MR. Is this a draw? Awesome. <laughs> a draw. Uh. There we go. I think I take out the Diana here. Two assassins not worth it here. I'll just play the Hecarim for the CC. At least we have a very big Swain now that's very, very tanky. Double Randuins? Yeah, that's kind of cool. Sack the Diana? Yeah, I could. If I'm going to sack the Diana, though, I may as well sack the Neela. Whoa, Ash Sween. Boom. Dragon Carousel. Oh, we know what we want. Okay, so now I can kind of be a duty head, I think. In fact, I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to be a duty head here. There we go. Six Dark Flight, five Cav, with Dark Flight Essence to make the Swain and the Rengar even bigger. And very good Rengar items. I think we lose this barely though? It's gonna be close. And Terra's doing work, and got it, barely. 
Does sacrificing a Dark Flight with Dark Flight Essence give it a stack immediately? I don't think so. I think that's the part that's like not quite working the way we'd want it here. But we can check. 60 AD. So we'll see how many stacks we get here. At this point, this feels silly. In fact, I think what I'm supposed to do now is go like this. Yes, it's one less Cav, but it's more Dark Flight Essence. I think that's a little stronger. All right, so 60. Yeah, so it doesn't give one right away. But whatever. The Morello doing a ton of work here. Cool. Why not Rel then? Yeah, Rel would be fine too. Titans just goes on Nunu. Alright, so what's left here? Five Cannoneer, almost six. With almost a three star Zeri. Tri Fury, six Swift Shot, and six Guild. Okay. Why is there no TFT pass on PB actually? Because the team hasn't taken the time to set that up, and there's nothing really to learn from it on PBE, so it's not a priority. Why is the item bench so restricted? I lost probably 10 games because I can't access my items who are on the left. Really? Seven Rengars, seven Swains, seven Rels. Something about the seven rings of seven whatevers? I don't know. Heal, Swain, heal. Heal, Swain, heal. Oh god, not quite. My main Rengar's still alive though, so we should be okay. Main Rengar's got this? Oh god, that was close. Whew. That was close. Eight Rengar's. Okay, if we win, we sell the rel because we know for never go for rel three, and then we get another rel in. <laughs> yeah, ten ringars. It's fine. Rel two or three, no diff. Well, we'll play two rels. Is the thing so. Swain's trying. Lock it? No, 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 no. Watch. As long as Rengar lives, which he's going to, we're good. Okay, yeah. So we do this, and then overtime hits, and... Oh, shit. I swear to God, if I lose this because of this, I'm going to have some feedback. Okay, we're good. No, 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 we're good, we're good, we're good. <laughs> that would have been some feedback. That would have been some feedback. Uh, we're good, we're good. We're good. It's fine.
He's fine. No sins? Nope. An extra Dark Flight Essence is more important. Alright, this feels like a first, though. Buy Diana? I don't need to buy Diana. What? This is this is my comp. We're happy with this comp. Rengar doesn't need to assassin. We're good. Uh, C6, H12, O6, Daddy, appreciate the two months. Thank you. Let's see. Scale score and scale score and Olaf. Hey, look. Look, we got Assassin. You just take Assassin. Woohoo. Assassin Nunu? Let's go. Assassin Nunu, let's go! Please? Yeah, this Swift Shot comp burns through my front line so fast, though. It's actually like a really hard matchup for me. Rengar's trying. Nope. Oh my god, I lost a Swift Shot Skarner. Look at that, we lost a swift shot at Skarner. And swift shot in Italy. And double Zeke's, jeez Louise. Skarner is very Chad, true. Like I said, this is the part where Swain starts to fall off because the enemy DPS gets too high and he can't maintain it. But that was a big new new eat back there. fights are way too close. Alright, someone redeemed it. Last Whisper pretty good here, is it? Who does this go on? Because doesn't it just have to go on Nunu? Which isn't really great. I actually think I'm going to reforge this. I don't think this is good. This was not better. I protected my Swain a little bit in this matchup. Because he was just getting bursted down too hard. Nope. 
We're out of damage now. Uh, Nidalee needs to die. Thank you. We can win this, I think. Good ult. Whew. God, these are close. No Swain. Cheers. We're up against Tri Fury again. I'm gonna try something to hopefully help a little here. He just hit two star Swain though, that's pretty rough for us. I'm hoping Rengar won't take nearly as much damage in this position. Yeah, that went much better. So yeah, positioning mattered a lot there. Whew. Okay. We did it. Nunu ate Skarner with a Giga, Giga Chad? True. Is the Force of Nerf rear ward real? Yep, sure is. All right, one more. One more. No Swain, though. I rolled so long for this Swain. I am so sad because of that. Dun, 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 I wish I could have hit. All right, well, hopefully this is a first. The RFC Hecarim is helping quite a bit too. Backline, big threats are dead. We might lose this though. That Graves is still going. Rengar's still alive, though. Graves is dead. Okay, we should be good. All right, finally, after a rough start, we managed to win a lobby. Yay, we did it. Woo. GG. Yeah, those Hecarim ults did a lot of work.